So when was the last time a really young person made you feel like an old man? Oh, gosh. I was shooting for a film on one of the streets in Mumbai some years ago. And uh, somebody came and said, you know, my mother is a great fan of yours, and can she come and meet you? And um, so she was almost an invalid. She was brought on a, on a charpai to the shooting set. And I bent down and I met her. And she must be close to 90 years old. And she said, Beta, I was coming from my childhood. <laughs> well, I mean, that tells you uh, something about durability. Zalme, we have uh, Zalme from Afghanistan Embassy. Uh, Zalme, Afghanistan has a big button fan club. Exactly. Uh, good evening, Mr. In fact, in fact, the only thing on which I remember when I used to cover the earlier jihad, uh -huh. uh, one thing on which all the Mujahideen group agreed was on Amitabh Bachchan. Exactly. Good evening, Mr. Amitabh Bachchan. My name is Zalmai, Zalmai Wafamal from the Embassy of Afghanistan, as uh, Shekhar said. Um, I've uh, seen you in two phases of my life. First, uh, my father was a diplomat long back here. Now I am in his shoes uh, back in the 80s, and we lived in Gulmohar Park. Uh, first time I saw, was, uh, I saw you was when you built your house in Gulmohar Park. And uh, I was such a big fan that I used to look at the uh, stars' names rather than the film names on the paper to select where to go. And that was your name, of course, I was looking for. The second time was I was a university student when you came to Kabul to shoot Khuda Gawa. That was, again, a very pleasant moment uh, from two respects. Number one, it reminded me of my old memories of Golmore Park that I used to see you in your car sometimes moving. And uh, then I saw you live there uh, shooting on Pula Arthal, uh, riding on the horse. Now, my question is, um, how was your experience, your overall experience in Afghanistan, in Kabul, and, and uh, the reaction of the people that you remember? I know, I know, they're all your fans. Uh, even, even the Mujahideen as Shakers say, <laughs> are your fans. Uh, how was your overall experience? And uh, then uh, I have a short question, a very short question that would require a yes or a no. First, I'd like to listen to your experience about being in That America. again will take a very long time, but uh, let me just say it, it was one of my most uh, impressive and fantastic visits uh, to your country. Um, your then president, uh, uh, Dr. Najibullah, uh, Dr. Najibullah uh, he had been uh, a great fan of Hindi cinema. And I remember that uh, when I had my accident on the sets of Kuli, he was, I think, on a flight uh, to Moscow uh, from Kabul. And he turned back and came back because he wanted to inquire after my health. And I was always very grateful for that. But uh, he had been sending many requests to the, the government of India that if he could ask us to come and shoot there or make a film there. And when we got the opportunity, we actually went there. It was a, a most amazing experience that I've ever had. Um, as you rightly said, you know, at that time, the Mujahideen uh, were uh, very aggressive. And uh, uh, President Najib had uh, two young daughters who were also fans. And one of them who was uh, very small. I think her name was Muskan. Muskan. Am I right? Yeah. Muskan, yeah. Yeah. She told her father, you know, Amitabh is coming and what is going to happen? We, the Mujahideen are bombing Kabul. Please tell them not to bomb today. <laughs> so we, um, we happily landed. And uh, oh, it's full of so many experiences. You know, you, a normal flight path of a plane that comes into land is, you know, you start slowing down from a very distant place and then you finally land but in Afghanistan you couldn't do that because you could be shot down so you actually f flew at almost 39,000 feet above Kabul and then you s circulated in a circle and came down into Kabul we went to see some warlords who uh, were with us in Mazar Sharif which is the place where we were shooting uh, and uh, they, the, the experiences that we had on the way uh, where the where the army 
was guarding certain places. And the moment we landed there, they, they reversed their rifles and they put a flower in the, in the barrel just as a, as a welcome gift. But the most amazing experience was when we um, landed in mazar sharif because that's where we were going to shoot the bush kashi and everything. And um, uh, President Najib had organized a lot of security for us. You know, we used to walk with tanks and planes flying over us just to protect us. Um, so when we landed in mazar sharif uh, we drove into the city. And I found hundreds and hundreds of people on the streets. And I said, wow, this is great. Uh, so many people have come to you know, greet us. Uh, how does this possible? This is a very remote area. He says, no, we're all fans, but they're not here to come to see you. They are people who have left their homes and have come out on the street to tell you that whichever home you pick to stay in, you are free to do that. So they've all left their homes and come on the street and said, you choose where you want to stay, and that home will be yours.